Welcome, welcome folks. This is Joe from Joe Thinks and we're playing Final Fantasy 7 Remake. Um, this is going to be chapter 2, which is Fateful Encounters, the chapter that Cloud meets Aerith in. So let's get into this. Bam. It even says it right there. If it... The Metropolitan Zone built atop Sector 8 plate, Midgar's newest and most picturesque sector is already a cultural hub, setting trends for the whole city. This district... Oh, I didn't get to read it all. Let's get into this, though. Looks like we made it. And with nothing but a few scratches to show. <laughs> I think you might have overdone it. I Just a tad. instructions to the letter. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako? Well, let's hope the city's still in one piece. But the planet's what matters, right? <laughs> I mean, this must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right, then. Lead the way. You got it. Huh. Watch out for live wires. They're everywhere. Ugh. The air in here reeks. Can't wait really to get it out the open. I guess. Man, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Oh, it's me. Gotta do something about that. I'm soon. I felt that one in my guts. Just yeah, keep it's on not going. smart to be underground. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick-me-up. How much farther do we have to go? Not far. Poor Jesse's grasping at straws, trying to understand how could my bomb have done that much damage. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back, then. I'll set the bomb. I no wonder she's scared of it right run. there. Can't wait to take a hot shower. She's good to go. I will blow you up, she says. Attention, all citizens. Attention, all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified intruders have detonated a bomb inside Mako Reactor 1. Multiple explosions Look have been that. confirmed, as well as ongoing fire. In response, a disaster warning has been issued in sectors 1 and 8. Structures in the area are at high risk of collapse, rendering the entire sector hazardous. Therefore, all residents of the No. Right. No way. This couldn't have been us, could it? But what if it was? What's done is done. <laughs> Merck's right. It ain't pretty, but we can't stop now. This was just the first reactor, and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah, we always knew this was gonna get messy. Mm. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. <laughs> but it's okay. Cause I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. Your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your fears. 
Whatever your problem, I got you. <laughs> so, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home! That's a nice little inspirational speech by Barrett. Slightly unnecessary, but very cool. Look at how pretty this is. We'll split up and shoot for the last train home. Regroup in the freight car. Got it? Later then. Like my money now. Yeah, right. Pay the man. Once we're back at base. That's why you always establish when you're gonna get paid per contract. Cloud would learn that later. I don't need to tell you what this is, right? I would hope not. Of course not. It's healing material. You can have it for saving my life. Just doing my job, nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <laughs> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. And you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. <laughs> Those yeah. words were not his. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? Okay, I was only trying to help. Oh, before I forget, here's a little something extra for being so brave. That really was the ride of a lifetime. Well, Cody Christian did train. such a good job at Cloud's voice. Doesn't look like it. I wasn't done looking around. Oh, jeez. That was a bad idea. Definitely stay out of the fire. Look at that. There's firefighters back there. They're working on it. If you're wondering, by the way, that was L2. Changes through the little mini map stuff uh, all throughout the game. You could. Well, then you're kind of screwed for now, aren't you? Yeah. yeah, you'll fall with it. Two more people up here. No, just that good. a lot of detail for a little bit of the area. A little bit of coin. Safe. Yeah, that's folks helping a little bit. 
Need a stretcher. ASAP. We'll get you to a doctor soon. Hang in there. The stairs are right there if you want to try crossing the rubble. Okay. Thanks for that. You're up here somewhere, Jesse. Three grenades. What happened? Another car explode or something? What? Why? We'll have to look back at the footage. Oh, I forgot about this part. Like, well, I just. Oh. Okay. Oh. Stuff's just falling. Are you hurt? No, I think I'm good. Thanks, bro. Is she hurt? Can you hear me? If you can, give us a sign. Got someone in need of medical attention. Send a stretcher. Yeah, you guys are EMS. There's a kid here. I guess he's not so much a kid. Sephiroth moment. Be sure to check out, uh, it's not out quite yet, but soon my Sephiroth video will be out. I'm working on a Sephiroth video. It's a theory video. I theorize that there's a new Sephiroth in this remake series. And this is meeting him. Kind of. Some coffee. Cloud. By the way, if you haven't caught on, I am not going to be... This is not spoiler friendly. Cloud knows. Remembers killing Sephiroth. Even if the rest of his memories are filled in with Zack by Genova. He clearly remembers that he killed Sephiroth and that he should be dead. And this is a little unsettling that his hometown, that Sephiroth burnt down, is to his left but not right, which is where Sephiroth's swing is. Wait. burning. Of course, it's more and more difficult to push Cloud up there as a player right now, too. You're not real. You're dead. I am. Um... I killed you with my own... <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then. And this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Painfully. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Oh. 
were the planet to die. So many things would be lost. Your hometown burns so bright. The sound of her voice, pleading from despair. The shiver of her flesh, yielding to cold steel. That which Set binds foreboding us together would for be no knowledge. More, and I would be loath to live in such a world. Which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry. It's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. Do you have to live? Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. Just connects, like, with a magnet or something. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. Might be. Uh, Might be. Guys. You know, I never tried to go back down this alleyway. Mm. Yeah, because he came down that way. Bit of trash for you. I love the parts where you walk around on the plates in Midgar. Because there's so very few. This place got hit too? What's happening down there? They said the whole plate. Everyone, please remain calm. No. Please, no. The expressway was damaged too? She's not saying nothing. Sure, we could try the alley, but is getting to the station really worth breaking our necks over? Yes, because we won't. Uh -oh. What did we do? <laughs> what if it happens again? Are we trapped here? I repeat. Well, I'm getting to that station way. if it kills me. An evacuation order has been issued. Quickly! We have to get him out! The military's on the way. Once they're here, there's no time! He needs help now! The explosions at the reactor have caused numerous. Everything was fine then! Many more are out of here. Please. It is not safe to remain indoors. Please leave your residences at once. Yeah, that happens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. An evacuation order has been issued to the occupants of buildings in the vicinity of the Sector 8 Expressway. So much work goes into that map that we just kick around. The explosives at the reactor have caused numerous ongoing fires. Many more are at risk. What a mess. Yeah, look at that. Jeez. It's gonna what take a while to do that. What do we do then? I'm so scared. Everybody here is so docile. And the world is actually coming. It won't be in this game though. Do what you like. I'm taking the kids to safety. No, we stay together. Yeah, together. I don't want to leave without you. Me too. I'm staying. An evacuation order has been issued to the office. Family stays together. Once you're on the street, you want to head for the plaza with the fountain. The station's not too far. Yeah, sector eight. That's where we're at, right? Yeah.
I had to stop and get a reality check for a minute in the story. We're about to meet Aerith. Boop. There's no going back. How do they expect us to evacuate? The mayor can kiss his job goodbye. Are you the dancing guy from later? They blew up the expressway too. So it's harder to get around. Good thing I stayed put. The fires can't reach us here. As long as reactor eight stays on. My friends at the station. This won't face Shinra anymore. Don't let the intruder escape. What intruder? Security's everywhere. Uh, maybe you can come back for it. Do believe we can. Could the mayor be behind this? Huh? Maybe it's part of a plot to tarnish President Jinra's name. Okay. The mayor could have been behind that. Spoilers. <laughs> I'm sure that Shinra will compensate you for all that. No, no more explosions. As a sailor would say, the captain goes down with the ship. Yeah. I heard it's total chaos near the reactor. It's my luck. The military won't let me through the closet. Aerith! <laughs> Dance around like a fa fairy, a flower fairy. Our Sephiroth from earlier. You are too weak to save anyone. Not even yourself. Are you okay? But he will be strong. Aerith is freaking out, and then Cloud is freaking out, and then Aerith gives Cloud a this flower. Neither of which are freaking out. A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. Team Tifa. I'm good. <laughs> oh, don't be like that. I know you want one. When was the last time you saw a real flower, huh? Plus, it'll make your girlfriend's day. I guarantee it. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case, <laughs> it's on the house. Enough already. I'll give you two gill for it. Two measly gill for a real flower? Come right? on. Five then. Please, that's not nearly enough. Besides, I clearly said it was on the. <sighs> You're trying to get rid of me for five lousy gill. <laughs> Sorry, but your plan won't work. <laughs> Lovers used to Aerith is so cute. They were reunited. Cute on purpose. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. He's warning her. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? <clears throat> Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- Help me! Now, he can see them. 
Keep in mind no one else can see them but Cloud and Aerith. That's the big question of Remake, is what are they? I'll try to be mostly spoiler friendly, but for other videos and stuff. Are you blind? You know, you're right. They're not blind, they can't see them. Wait. So Cloud looks like a crazy man swinging a sword around in the street. But they're patiently waiting for the <laughs> moment to be over. No. Let's go. This is gonna be so much fun. All right. So now we're gonna go back through the areas that we couldn't go to before. You know. How we had started out here, and I was like, oh man, really want to go get that materia. Only got to fight for it, as you see. I've got it on normal mode for right now, after having completed the whole game on hard. You can check out the first video in the Final Fantasy VII Let's Play series that I'm doing. As well for everything that kind of leads up to this. Uh, it's actually been a little bit, and I've been going Final Fantasy crazy since I first played this game. All the way through and platinumed it. So it's a fun return for me to it. A nice hit point up material. I vaguely remember there being something else down there, but it might be a one-time. This game has an awful lot of one-time things. Or, like in the case of that materia, or one of these materia is uh, different after you get it the first time. Or I could be wrong. But that is a case of there are an awful lot of things that are one-time. Once you get it, something else permanently replaces it. Or you can't get it more than once, just in general. I believe it's Mako Reactor 5 or Mako Reactor 5 that, it? that I need. Move the metals! Not that that really does me any good anymore. We got Reactor 5, 6, and 7. Upper plate. No, I could get that here somewhere, Riot Trooper. Because this is upper sector 8. Just in the building. 5. Building. 5. So I need to go to 5. I need to get riot troopers from here. Oh, before we finish with that, let's make sure I have the ability to scan anything. Just gonna deadly dodge off for right now. Now we can scan riot troopers when we see them. It should be dudes with shields. Oh, 
So much going on. Well, that's the end of that. The report is your dudes are gone. So much for the direct route. Find another way. Use the roof to It's true. Let's look around. But the rooftops are clear. Thanks for that, Cloud. Maybe they're respawning and they barked out and I heard it. Looks like the station's crawling with public security. Over there! Open fire! Shoot to kill! Shoot to kill. Whoa. Close call. They took that seriously. Side of the fire now. Don't Wait, right, trooper, sir? Oh. I'm waiting. Thank you. Let's I got scan you. Alright, trooper achieved. I see him! Now you're in for it. <laughs> That's that. You go. No. <laughs> Nothing to it. Confirm! Target has entered residential area! All lockdown is in effect! All units! <laughs> still block it, I can still crit on it. That you've got, like, so little defense. So pretty. Don't go outside, folks. 
could get hit with things that have fallen. See, the people of Midgar. They were taken care of. That was a bad call. Uh, residential area. We will be back in chapter 9. And helicopters in chapter 7. For now, we're going to explore the last of it. We got to meet Aerith. We got to meet Sephiroth. Got another Moogle medal. And we're about to get a nice juicy boss fight. With lots of bad guys. usually much more difficult than that. The trick to the Huntsman is to do exactly that. Set up an... Felt a damn good jumper. But you set up a situation where you are always hitting a counter-attack when they attack you. Guess Cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? They're like, what the hell? Uh, you had me worried for a minute. Huh? Huh? Uh, what the hell you been up to? Worried for Cloud? Giving public security the runaround. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> Wait. Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Uh, what? Invisible enemy? Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <laughs> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. Barrett is not far from the truth. A lot of people here. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky this us. We've got a crowd to hide. And all these people are getting off of the plate. An explosion at Mako Reactor 1. An emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. I just want to get home. Wow, I'm good time for the people riding in the freight car. I say don't have much choice, but rather them than me. Huh. Sector 8, back to normal in no time. It has to be. Are you oh, the one who's so cramped? 
Man, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. I can't believe it. Stop that right clouds. now! I am. Um... If you're about to unburden yourself, don't. Sheesh. <laughs> you don't make it easy. Thieves getting my money. Hey, got a sack of coin. Who ties to blame? Just leave me alone, all right? You see, my daughter now lives in Sector 8, so... You're, uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Why don't Even you learn to take a hint, Even after what we saw at the station buddy. and all over Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Well, my hands are still shaking. You get used Why to it. Why don't you learn to take a Something hint, Something to look buddy. forward to. Yay. Maybe not. Have they caught the perpetrators yet? Cloud's such a douche. Yeah, lady. Have you heard the rumors? Someone's trying to take down Shin. I'll help Cloud. I'm sure Sector Please. Seven's affected too. No, she well, hell. wouldn't let that happen. I can't believe I survived that. I can't stop thinking about it. The bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail safes to prevent that kind of thing? You would think. You mentioned or they would explode all the time. Back there, right? Right. Oh, no. Invisible I'm just looking enemies. for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. Maybe some grounders did it as payback? Don't be stupid. Yeah. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <sighs> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Just, just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? <laughs> uh, uh, shh. Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A Look message to all the best around his abdomen. Dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear, y'all's masters. <laughs> we will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> New versus old ideas. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. I really recommend checking out. Um, Barrett has his own short story in On the Way to a Smile, the hey, Final Fantasy VII short so stories. And how much rage he has is is amazing. Obviously, play the entire like full game. I can't wait to get to Calm, and then to you know the mining town that he's from. You hear that suit, Shinra Creed? My ass. We're the good guys, damn it. You hear that suit, Shinra Creed? My ass. I didn't hear anything. You gotta believe me. <laughs> like we're minding our own business. They'd probably kill us if they knew we were the ones responsible. No, don't think about it. They'd probably kill us if they knew we were the ones responsible. Well. I get it if you can't relate. Are 
Really? Why is it so awkward to talk to them? There we go. Shower might help. The long hot one. You gotta basically be up in their shit to talk to them. Except Barrett here. Let's get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, gonna teach us about the train. Right. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not. S There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This I guess there's supposed to be half a million people As that live see, here. It'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history. All that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. A visual aid. What I tell you? To have show us. Safe. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako. While the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. Mm hmm. I don't believe they do. Like this train, I suppose. There's only one way it can go. Well, we're gonna end it there for right now. If you like this type of content, be sure to hit the like button. That way I can know and I will keep making more stuff like this for sure. If you haven't yet, subscribe. And if you hit the notification bell, you'll be notified when I release new videos. I've also been playing the Final Fantasy VII original game and making videos about that that are sectioned off in chapters, exactly like Final Fantasy VII Remake is. As always, thanks for watching, and remember, be kind to one another, and save often.